How many times are you just laying in bed thinking, bro, I am so bored, I got nothing to do? Or maybe a parent or a superior looks at you and tells you, bro, you're always lazy, you're never doing anything. Or sometimes maybe you just feel unmotivated. I'm here to tell you that you're not bored, you're not lazy, and you're not unmotivated. Let me explain. You just haven't found your passion. See, once you find your stride, I promise you, your motivation is gonna come. Your laziness is gonna go out the door and your boredom is gonna cease. Why? Because you just found something that you love doing and the process itself rewards you. See, I love creating content, building businesses and scaling them. So working is not actually feel like work. The work is fulfillment in and of itself because that process, that growth, that's what fuels the fire, that's what motivates me. And the never ending task list of running five different businesses keeps boredom at bay. So you need to start doing a little bit of everything. Explore more, adventure more, read more. And that little idea that you've had in the, in the back of your head that's nagging you, that's annoying you for years, but you've been putting it to the side, I want you to do it. You're also comparing yourself against the 1%. See, what you constantly are feeding your brain and what you're seeing every day is that 1% of Instagram accounts or TikTok accounts that keep appearing on your feed. That ends up skewing your perception of reality and what actually happens in the lives of 99% of the people. So no, it's not that you're lazy or you got nothing to do. It's that you constantly are seeing the top 1% and think that your life is boring compared to theirs. You also have internal motivation. See, what you don't realize is that everyone has it, you're just using it for certain tasks that aren't benefiting you. For example, when you have schoolwork to do, or a project to finish at work, or some sort of tedious task, you're not motivated to do that, but you're highly motivated to avoid doing that task. So what you need to understand is that everybody has motivation since every action we take is rewarded with an incentive. You not doing that certain task is immediately rewarding you with peace, with being stress-free. On the other hand, you could finish your schoolwork and be rewarded with a good grade, or you could finish your task at work and be rewarded with a check at the end of the week or even a promotion. The difference is that doing the harder task elongates your incentive versus doing the easier task shortens your incentive or gives you your incentive immediately. And since we suck at delaying our gratification, we are usually more motivated to do the task that doesn't actually benefit us. So in your mind, the reward of doing nothing or resting in your mind is perceived higher than the reward of actually completing the task. Because this rolls us on to the next tip. See, you're not bored, you're just boring. And I know that sounds harsh, but I'm your older brother and I'm here to give it to you straight so you can actually get out of that boredom. See, nobody is just bored all the time. You just maybe live a life that's a little bit too boring. See, most of us can build up hobbies, adventures, activities, but you choose not to. This is exactly why I preach so much Get a hobby, whatever it is. It could be jujitsu, chess, video. I don't care what the hobby is. You'll likely start meeting new people within each group that's, there, that's gonna start building your social circle. Then I want you to start adding tasks. So if your goal is to start a business, make that a task and then tackle that task. Then I want you to start getting healthy, which means I need you to start going to the gym and set a goal for yourself. Go to the gym three times a week, then four times, then five times. Then I want you to start meal prepping. You see how quickly you're no longer gonna be living that boring life, but instead you're gonna have task after task after task. But at the end of the day, all of this, all of this doesn't matter because of one single thing. And th this is your internal demon. You're, this is the battle that you face every day. That's fear, the fear of failure and the fear of success, the fear of looking stupid in front of your friends and family for trying, the fear of losing someone. See, a lot of times what's stopping you from moving forward is the fear. For example, we all fear that we're not gonna be successful or rich. However, the fear of losing what we already have, what gives us comfort is much higher than the fear of not being rich. Which is why it's so easy to be lazy or to procrastinate or to have boredom, to not do or affect anything that you already have. Because God forbid your friends end up mocking you for trying to level up or you try and everything just ends up flopping. See. Fear is what keeps you lazy, what keeps you bored, and what keeps you unmotivated. Boys, see, you're not lazy, you're not bored, and you're not unmotivated. You have it in you. You just need to understand that what's stopping you is that fear. That's it for me today, boys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop us a like down below. See you guys next time.